Welcome, welcome to my channel, folks. It's Nika Lassa, and today I'm doing a very quick video just to show you what I did with my Vanderspeck that I received yesterday. So I don't know if you watch the reveal of it, but it had a lot of patina on it, which is shine. And as you can see, it's nice and dull right now, and I love it like that. I did go ahead and clean it with my tried and true Huggies Baby Wipes. It was even dirty back here, right on the clasp. It's gone. I did a once over on it. Um, I absolutely love my Huggies Baby Wipes um, in the natural care. I even use it on my Louis Vuitton. And so I actually wipe down my Louis Vuitton handles at least uh, once every month. As long as I'm carrying this, I'll wipe it down once a month. And just to keep it even, um, patina and nice and clean. I don't like any type of uh, patina handles or dirty handles on a Louis Vuitton. I can't stand it. This is from 2008 so it is older and as you can see it is aging beautifully. I do this video to show you that you don't have to be afraid of watermarks or um, I'm not saying put it out in the rain but you don't have to be afraid to use your items. Um, similarly, I'd asked a question on the site, the Facebook group site, of whether I could clean Janet leather. And I am totally familiar with leather and leather restoration. I've been doing Coach and Louis Vuitton for a while. But what I didn't want to happen is for this to be damaged. But I just decided, you know what, it's no different than the Vachetta leather that Louis Vuitton uses on their bags. And so... I did a once over on it. I will tell you that doing a once over, um, there's still a little bit of patina and stains that remain, as you can see that stain there, but I don't need it to be perfect. It looks great based upon how it was. It was just dirty, that's all, and used. I like it matte. Um, it makes it a little darker, so if you are, um, it just does. I mean, it, it gets dark when it's wet, but then it dries. Let it dry completely. Do not follow with any type of conditioner or anything like that. Like, it's made to just be this. And it is gorgeous. There it is in focus. Okay? I was even able to remove the pen mark. If you guys remember from yesterday, there was a pen mark here on my Touch Me Rose. And then here on the clasp, it was dirty from touching against the uh, leather here. I was able to clean that. All I used was Huggies Baby Wipes, the natural care. That is my tried and true, okay? And I just wanna kinda flip through and let you see that I've set her up. I'm completely in love with this thing. I've taken a few pictures and posted it on the, um, you know, the fan website and that. Um, I'm in love with, with this, so and this whole thing. <laughs> All right, it was a very quick video. I just wanted to show you that and tell you that you can go ahead and use Huggies Baby Wipes on your Janet. As you can see, look at that. You can see kind of like it's a little lighter under my clasp, okay? Nature to Janet Leather. It naturally just ages and dark darkens over time. Again, if you don't want it darker, um, a shade darker, you might not want to do this but um, this totally cleans the leather and gets that shine out of there and makes it more matte. It feels great. All right, you guys, please comment down below, like, and subscribe. Let me know what you would like to see me do. Upcoming for you is going to be a Vanderspeck pocket that I am getting in, and I also have some cool Louis Vuitton repairs coming up, okay? Enjoy your night. Thank you.